Good evening and welcome to this video tutorial by myself Tisui from IMView and uh, today we'll be setting up the um, 3DS Max with the IMView exporters and we'll be doing this with the latest version it's been a few years since I've done this uh, tutorial for you guys and uh, it's been, and since uh, the last time I did it I believe it was uh, 2011 and a lot of things have changed so I'm going to show you how just to set up the latest one and the first thing you're going to need is we're just going to go to the creator program and we need the exporters you can go down to the bottom of the page here and sorry it's right here the exporters and we are going to need the 2015-2016 uh, Cal 3D exporters okay so that's now downloaded and you're going to want to get the free trial from uh, 3ds max now you need to make sure that you do have the minimum uh, system specifications for your computer for it to actually work so if you want to just check your minimum your, your system specs let's go have a quick look um, just open up the uh, Windows Explorer right click on this computer and just go to properties and what you need is a 64-bit operating system, um, preferably on an Intel processor. And I've got an Intel i7, that's okay. Uh, or you can have an AMD uh, multi-core processor, which should also work. And I believe it is 4 gigabytes of RAM and higher is what you need. Um, so this PC actually sp it works out perfect for it. Um, system requirements you can just read up the minimum over here and if you just have a look for the 3ds max 2016 system requirements and it requires a browser uh, Windows 7 or higher and it should be a, a home edition not a server edition and as it says over there, 64-bit Intel processor of 4 gigabytes of RAM of higher. Um, you also need 6 gigabits of uh, free um, mem of, of disk space. Um, if you don't have it, you won't be able to install it or start it. Okay, so um, and that needs to be on your system drive as well. Okay, so you just go ahead and you click on the uh, download now on the free trial window there. And you accept both of these. And then once you uh, click continue, the download is going to start. Okay, I've already done it once. But okay, let's just go in and start the installer now for the 3DS Max. You're just going to agree to this. And as you see, it's initializing. I'm just going to go into install on this computer. And the C drive is perfect for me. Okay, so it looks like we're done uh, installing the 3D Max software. So uh, next thing that we need to do is just check that it's uh, installed properly. Everything's now installed properly according to this. Uh, just just finish that. Now let's just start the software. Now when it starts, we're going to have a quick look, and we'll see, I'll show you that the uh, exporters for uh, 3D Max, Cal, sorry for IM View are not installed by default we have to actually install them in manually which we'll be covering in a second okay so just sign up if you don't have an account
Okay, and we're just going to go continue to complete the act activation. Okay, so we got the uh, welcome to your free trial. We're just going to go continue trial. I'm just going to select the classic mode for now because we're going to be meshing objects and then uh, okay we just go original startup okay so if we go in here, the first thing I want you to notice is you can just click on this uh, max icon over here. And if we go to export and we go to export again over here, um, this is where we would usually select the type of exporter that we would like to use. And as you'll notice, Cal3D is not there. And Cal3D, if you don't know, is the uh, exporter that we use for IMVU. So I'm going to show you how to install that now. So we're just going to close off 3D Max. And we're going to go to these uh, export exporter files that we downloaded earlier. Just open those up. And you're just going to go into that folder. And we're just going to select them both. I'm going to go copy, go into the C drive, and we're going to go into program files, go into order disk, go into max, go copy and paste these in here, and just give it continue. So it's in the 3D max uh, folder 2016. So now you're going to see, once you've copied them in, that the Cal3D file is now in the 3D Max folder. There it is. And if we go into plugins, you'll see the Cal3D exporter, the Max exporter is now there. So close that off and we go into 3D Max. We just open it up again and you can go and see that it's loaded now and we've got, if we go into the Max icon again and we have a look in here and we go into the export and we go into export again you're going to see there are your exporters for the Cal 3D ready to go and launch to, to export your first mesh and that's it for now and we'll come back to you in the next video tutorial where we'll export the first mesh and get it ready for IMView okay so that brings us to the end of our first video tutorial on how to actually set up the 3D Max with the Iron View exporters. In the next video tutorial, we'll be covering the uh, fun stuff. We've now done with all the geeky stuff, and the fun stuff is what you've really come here for, which is to learn how to export your first mesh. And we will be building a basic chair, which we'll be preparing with uh, assigning its textures and everything, and getting it ready for exporting. Uh, we will then cover the exporting process and then um, importing this into the IMView client as a product. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial and we will be back within the next few minutes with the next video.